Great Comets. When will the next comet be visible? October 2024 is turning out to be a historic month for comet enthusiasts. Comet C2023A3, Tsuchinshan Atlas, has become the brightest comet seen in the past 27 years, surpassing every comet since the legendary hale in 1997. What exactly makes a comet great? In this video, we'll explore what qualifies a comet for this rare title and share the latest insights on two comets, C2024G3 Atlas and C2024E1 Wierschos. Upcoming celestial spectacles expected to light up the skies in 2025 and 2026. Join us as we dive into the beauty, science, and history behind some of the greatest comets ever seen. Comet C2023A3 is dazzling both astronomers and skywatchers alike, already being the brightest since 1997. But what exactly makes a comet great? And when can you catch a glimpse of these celestial wonders? A great comet is a term often used to describe comets that make an extraordinary impact both visually and scientifically. Unlike regular comets, which may be faint or only visible through telescopes, a great comet is bright enough to be easily seen with the naked eye, often even from urban areas with light pollution. These celestial objects capture the imagination of millions of people around the world with their dramatic appearances and long, glowing tails that stretch across the night sky. While there is no strict, official definition of what makes a comet great, several key factors contribute to a comet earning this title. A great comet typically reaches an apparent magnitude of one or brighter, making it as luminous as the brightest stars in the sky. For comparison, first magnitude stars like Vega or Altair are easily visible to the naked eye. Some great comets, such as Comet hale in 1997, have even reached negative magnitudes, making them stand out as some of the brightest objects in the night sky. A comet's brightness is influenced by how close it comes to both Earth and the Sun. Comets that pass near Earth have their brightness amplified, making them more visible. Additionally, when a comet approaches the Sun, the increased solar radiation heats up its nucleus, causing the comet to release gas and dust in large quantities, forming the iconic glowing tail. Great comets are famous for their long and majestic tails, which can span millions of miles. These tails are formed as the comet's nucleus sublimates, releasing gas and dust particles that are pushed away by the solar wind and sunlight. The tail often splits into two types, the ion tail, composed of charged particles, and the dust tail, which reflects sunlight. The visibility and length of these tails contribute to the comet's grandeur and awe-inspiring appearance. Some great comets are long-period comets, originating from the distant Oort cloud, a region far beyond Pluto. These comets take thousands of years to complete an orbit, meaning their appearances are rare and often a once-in-a-lifetime event. For example, Comet Hayakutake, 1996, and Comet hale bopp 1997, are not expected to return for thousands of years. Each year, hundreds of small comets travel through the inner solar system, yet only a handful manage to capture the public's interest. In October 2024 alone, 12 comets were sighted. 
However, on average, only about one comet per decade shines brightly enough to be visible to the naked eye in the night sky. This October was truly extraordinary, offering the rare chance to witness not one but two potential great comets. While one comet remains on its journey, the other, C2024-S1, Atlas, unfortunately disintegrated shortly after reaching perihelion. Here's a closer look at each. C2023-A3, brightest comet since 2011. Discovered in early 2023, Comet C2023-A3 has taken the astronomy world by storm. Visible to the naked eye for a brief period in October, it's already being hailed as the brightest comet since 2011. While it hasn't yet earned the title of a great comet, its stunning brightness and long, glowing tail have made it one of the most photographed comets in recent memory. Take a look at my own images of the comet, captured between October 18th and 19th with my Pentax K1 in Astro Tracer mode. I recommend watching a special video dedicated to the C2023A3 Suchinshan Atlas comet, and the link should appear in the top right corner of the screen. Like the mythical Icarus, Comet C2024-S1 Atlas perished after straying too close to the Sun. Once thought to be a potential celestial spectacle, Atlas had been predicted to outshine Venus by late October, making it visible even in daylight. But on Monday, October 28th, Atlas met its end as it approached perihelion, the closest point to the Sun in its orbit. Earlier hopes that this comet might become a Halloween spectacle were dashed, as astronomers began noticing signs of its disintegration earlier in October. Now, thanks to the Solar and Heliospheric Observatory, SOHO, a joint mission by NASA and the European Space Agency, we have a clear view of how and when Comet Atlas disintegrated. Atlas made its closest pass by Earth on October 23rd, reaching a magnitude of 8.7, far too faint for the naked eye, but observable through telescopes. After that, the comet headed toward the sun, moving out of sight for all but specialized solar instruments. Discovered only on September 27th by the Asteroid Terrestrial Impact Last Alert System, Atlas Project in Hawaii, Siege 2024-S1 belongs to a family of comets called Kreutz Sungrazers. These comets follow a similar orbital path, swinging close to the Sun every 500 to 800 years, depending on their individual trajectories. Like all comets, C2024 S1 Atlas was a dirty snowball, a remnant of the early solar system composed of frozen gases, dust, and rocks dating back 4.6 billion years. This ancient visitor from the outer solar system had a brief moment in our sky before its icy form succumbed to the sun's intense heat. For more detailed information on the C2024-S1 Atlas Comet, Watch the special video now linked in the top right corner of the screen. If you've missed recent comet appearances, don't worry. Two potentially bright comets are coming soon and they may be visible to the naked eye. Here's what to know about Comet C24G3 Atlas and Comet C2024E1 Wirschhos two exciting celestial visitors expected to light up our skies in 2025 and 2026. Discovery and Background Comet C2024 G3 Atlas was discovered on April 5, 2024 by the Atlas Asteroid Terrestrial Impact Last Alert System Survey. 
This comet is making its first journey into the inner solar system, promising an intriguing show for astronomers and stargazers alike. Currently located in the constellation Lupus, it's about 2.26 astronomical units from Earth with a relatively faint magnitude of 11.9, according to the Comet Observation Database, COPS. When and where to look. On January 13, 2025, Comet Atlas will reach perihelion, its closest approach to the Sun, coming within just 0.094 astronomical units, about 14 million kilometers. During this close encounter, it may reach a brightness of magnitude 0.6, making it visible to the naked eye, and potentially even during the daytime. However, viewing conditions will be challenging. The comet will be difficult to spot from the northern hemisphere, and will only appear in the southern hemisphere's night sky about a week after perihelion, likely at a dimmer magnitude by then. Discovery and Background Discovered by Polish astronomer Dr. Kotzper Wierzkosz on March 3, 2024, using the Mount Lemmon Observatory in Arizona, Comet C-2024E1 Wierzkosz has been steadily traveling inward toward the Sun. Currently in the constellation Hercules, it's far from Earth and faint at a magnitude of 18.8. As it moves closer, however, it is expected to brighten considerably, potentially becoming visible to the naked eye. When and where to look. Comet Wierzchos will reach perihelion on January 20th, 2026, passing 0.55 astronomical units from the sun, about half the distance between Earth and the sun. This close pass should cause its ice and gases to heat up and release a substantial tail and coma. Then on February 17, 2026, it will make its closest approach to Earth at a distance of 0.824 astronomical units, approximately 123 million kilometers. During this time, it is projected to shine at a magnitude of 6.2, making it visible under clear, dark skies. Why these comets are special Several features make Comet Atlas and Comet Wierzchos particularly exciting for comet watchers. Close proximity to the Sun. Both comets will pass within 0.094 to 0.55 astronomical units of the Sun, close enough to potentially develop long, striking tails. Potential naked eye visibility. With projected magnitudes ranging from 0.6 to 6.2, these comets could be visible to the naked eye which is rare for comets. Atlas may even be bright enough for daytime viewing. Rarity. It's unusual to have two such promising comets in a short span, and both may be visible without telescopes or binoculars, making them accessible to everyone. Keep watching the skies. While Comet Atlas and Comet Wierzchos are two of the most anticipated comets on the horizon, the cosmos is full of surprises. New comets are often discovered unexpectedly, appearing only weeks or months before they become visible. Astronomers and amateur stargazers alike are always on the lookout, ready to share their findings with the world. So, mark your calendars for these upcoming cosmic events and prepare for the chance to witness a comet lighting up the sky. Don't miss out on these once-in-a-lifetime sights. As we conclude this virtual odyssey, we invite you to like and subscribe to our channel to embark on further cosmic explorations. With every click, you elevate our pursuit of knowledge and contribute to the collective understanding of our universe.